today we got a 250 covered edition review for you jim just traded some great customers from augusta georgia out of this truck for f450 iconic silver getting that beauty right there and we have so many great customers from across the entire country coming to see us the focus for today leveled on 37's covert lego I know you're all probably wanting to know, real deal, when the 23 is coming. They're coming. It's going to be a little while, so you got to be appeased by these 22s. These are still great trucks. The Lariat platform is a great one to start out with, with the leather and all the amenities on the inside, blind spot monitor. You got heated and cooled seats, big 12 inch touchscreen. Look at the backup camera there. And you know I love that offset. So look at that zero offset on a hostile wheel, how much it sticks out on a mile to wide scale. It's about two and a half inches which is just right to me for this setup just finished that iconic silver right there reviews coming out for it on friday it's leveled on 37s too we have another white one right there on 37s with tis wheels check out my new hat just got in the mail for me my dad and brady the natty back to back hat what you know about it many of you all may not need or like 37s on a super duty and i get that but i'm just trying to showcase and display that to me 37s are the best balance a truck on this leveled setup like our covert package presents is not too tall it's not too much because the old school process and thought is you got to go six inches on these super duty trucks to clear 37s that is not the case we're two and a half inch leveled with a non-aggressive wheel and tire combo as far as our mile to wild scale we know the sweet spot to roll on 37s and not be too cumbersome for everyday driving I wanted to showcase in this area here because we are your source for everything auto. We have so many Super Duties currently, even in this day and age, we still have a great inventory y'all. So hit us up, akinsford.com for all your truck needs. These stock trucks have 34 inch tall tires by 10.8 inches wide, 275, 65, 20. It has a good look to it. It's nice, but it doesn't compare to a legit 37, 12 and a half, 20. This to me fits the proportion of the truck so much better. It gives you better characteristics like overall ride quality and handling experience. I'm just telling you that even though this is a mud terrain tire on this one, compared to this road tire, I just think the driving experience from an everyday standpoint is better here. Obviously too, you can go with 35s, and get a easier drivability. The sidewall being that much more bolsterous and tall on a 37 improves the ride quality. It's just science. Our latest Oxford White Aikens Ford F250 Lariat Covered Edition has many upgrades, including a trimmer valence up front, and I can show you the distinct difference. It's easy to see custom versus stock. Look how low that hangs down. To me, it just does not look good. This has a better overall appeal to it. Now, yes, you may be sacrificing some aerodynamics in this, but are you looking to save 0.2 miles per gallon? Or are you looking to have more smiles per gallon? And I'm all about the smiles, y'all. Looks so much better that way. Options you could add up here would be a custom painted emblem up front, Morimoto XB LED headlights, just to improve overall uh, visibility while driving at night and obviously looking better at the same time. How do we get this to fit? We're on a two and a half inch ready lift core spring level kit. We're on hostile wheels, 20 by nine, zero offset. A good look at the core spring there. It's just a simple part replacement, a track bar relocation bracket and shock extension. So you don't have to change these shocks out while doing this kit. While I do recommend it, it's not required. And this is just our entry level cover as far as options that we chose on this one as well as Ant Research Power Pull Running Boards because a lot of these layers we've been getting have just the standard, I don't like this, those flat running boards. And several of these do not even have running boards. So definite way for entry and exit to be improved even more so than a stock truck is through the Ant Research, which drops down three inches lower than the standard board. So even if you have a board on your truck and need easier entry and exit, the Ant Research Power Deployable, three inches lower, so you got confident rolling in with your jays or whatever you're rocking with we have the weathertech im full liners these are an improved from the tried and true weathertech these are the best in the business in my opinion for overall coverage and protection and feel they feel great a little more rubbery than the previous years where they've had more of a vinyl feel to it window sticker pause here for factory options on nef 73834 here are our covert edition options pause here for that 
89817, properly equipped with great options. I got to give a shout out to my man George. George at Mayor's in Linux Mall came through. And Kirk Insula, thanks to you too. You gave the connection there. Great people. And it's what it's all about in life is connections, y'all. All about the connections. So having a deep network is going to benefit you in many ways. Power board folds up like money my favorite shot is right here the notorious side shot looking great you can see we are money set up leveled if anything we may be a uh, half an inch taller in the rear i think it's perfect overall for a truck of this size and capability leveled on 37s two and a half inch coil spring in the front four inch block in the rear 37s whatever wheel size you want to roll with it i really do like this hostile h127 titan wheel and the gloss black and milled finish it works well because we've got the milling to accentuate the chrome and we got the gloss just to go with the overall theme of our black and white combo but you gotta have some milling in the wheel in my opinion to tie in with the chrome especially when you got so much as far as side badges badging down below grill in the headlights front and rear bumpers it's everywhere and it's very pricey to get rid of it so the best way to keep it and live with it is incorporate it so a nice incorporation and then out back we did a ready lift four inch block because just a two and a half in the front to me has that front side being a little bit higher than the rear so i like it anything uh, just a nice towable looking truck to where we're definitely not front side heavy but we're definitely not just perfectly level to where if you're towing something it's going to be squatted let's get wheel well liners in the back because without it let me just go ahead and run over here and show you what you look like without the liner i mean you got to get the guards you got to get the wheel guards because that's just like man it, it, it's ford leaves something out or did we not put something in there and coming here you can see under that rear wheel well it just cleans it up wild to wild scale we're about two and a half inches outside the fender which is a great balance for this size truck gives you better overall handling characteristics and then we've started to incorporate our covert edition badges on our covert trucks a nice total way to show you that you're in a wild with this custom ready lift block in the back in four inch fashion to get us to that right height that we desire as far as the overall stature and here a good look at the truck i hope these videos are educational for y'all i hope you enjoy listening to a country boy talk about trucks every day but it's something we're truly passionate about and making trucks better for you the consumer is what it's about it's not about just doing things that we think need to be done for whatever reason it's like we have a purpose like we want to take this truck right here and still keep it usable and functional to its maximum but in a way that looks better and performs better for you the customer that's what our covert edition package is about we have a black six inch lifted everest edition coming to you soon on 38 so stay tuned for that plus window edition raptors and many more customs including f-150 covert and mini f450 western reserves and reserve editions you gotta stay tuned hit that subscribe button because we're getting our inventory back and once we get it back we ain't stopping y'all you're gonna love what we got to show you in 2023 everyone's trying to forecast what the economy is going to do i'll tell you what the economy is going to do the economy is going to be real deal right here at wild with us and akins ford in winer georgia we're going to make sure we take care of you for everything auto and the rest will take care of itself we got you covered on the automotive industry and that's what matters so until next time stay tuned hit that subscribe button i got you covered peace out